guys, today we are back at the shop. Guess what? I finally got my lift put in. Now, I think I want to have another one over here. Well, it? I'm still deciding. Let me know in the comments. Should I put a lift over here? Well, I'll leave the table, but should I put a lift, like, maybe up here or something? Um, so we can put something in here, or should I just leave this one? Because I feel if I put one there, it kind of bothers me. It's offset, but it shouldn't be that bad. But should I put one on that bay, too, or leave it? And the size of that, yeah, I can almost put one there, but let me know in the comments should I put one there in the shop or not. But it does work and everything, so we will be able to use that and everything. But today, we are going to fire up the old 6 0. And we are going to be going to look at a power uh, or a, a ram charger. What in the world? A ram charger. We're going to go look at stuff. Um, it's supposed to be used by a this company for like a little work truck and everything so if it looks pretty good i think it's like a 77 or something so if it looks pretty good we are going to pick it up they're wanting like uh four grand for it which ain't too bad we made like a thousand dollars off the dirt bike and everything like that just change the plastic and the seats and stuff so that's not too bad so i think we're going to go splurge and maybe buy this truck and i'm definitely going to fix the old chevy that we have over there step side I need to fix it so I get it over here and sold and stuff and hopefully we sell some more vehicles and stuff but we're gonna go look at this truck and if it's good we're buying it all right while well, I was driving by one of the firemen flagged me down and stuff and said that the, the the chief absolutely loved the fire truck and everything and they might have some work more work in the future for me so that's always good so let's go ahead and continue our journey that's supposed to be either a left or right up here I'm thinking Sit right. I'm not for sure, but I'm going to cut through this. Probably get pulled over and get a ticket. I don't know. You never know. I don't... Wait a minute. They said it was... Wait, it's... Okay. We're, I, I think we're going the wrong way. So let me go ahead and turn around. I think it was a left that's like... Oh, that car was wrong. I remember it's a left. And they said it was... place. I'm guessing that's the food place. There's, there's, there's another, is that another food place on there? Alright, this is going to be where Bay Doors was near a food place. That's a food place. But I don't know if that's a food place or not. Bay Doors, we are looking for a truck. Maybe we, oh, is that it? Oh, that is it. I was like, maybe we need to turn around. Oh, it's power, uh, uh, power wagon by Dodge. Oh, yeah. Did I say we was looking for a Ram Charger? It's a power wagon. I am so confused right now. Good grief. I should have knew what we went through. I like, I love Dodges, but I, I just got confused for a minute. All right, so this is, I think it's like a 77 or something. I really like it. Not digging the all white and everything. I think this might be like the stock rims and stuff for it. So, maybe I would put a nice paint job on this thing. Look pretty good. Uh, let me guess if they got the keys. Alright, so I got the keys. We're going to look in here real good. Start it up. Ooh. Pretty nice. I'm going to try it. They say it's used as like a shop truck and everything. It's kind of what it's been used all its life. Alright, I don't think it's going to win any races, but it's absolutely super nice. Alright. 4,000 on black. I got three three green crash. We got my trailer. We're out of here. All right, so I said four or three green cash. Okay, 3550 and we're out of here. That's what we came up with. I think that's pretty good. Truck has some nice tires and stuff, but I think we're going to do something else to it. Not for sure. I don't know. I feel like we should lift it. We might just get like a simple lift. Uh, it is leaf spring and stuff, so we might put some like leaf blocks on it put you know a nice set of tires and I definitely want to change the paint job so why don't even turn it off so I think that's what we're going to do we're going to do that we're going to take it back to the shop put some leaf blocks on it we should have something for the lift and everything and then we're heading out or then we're going to paint it I'm sure we got something it'd be cool if we put those old like uh fin style like fan looking rims and stuff on it that's that old school look all right, Ford, let's rock and roll. 
as I drive over their their blocks there. Can I get this way? I can. Alright, we're going to get ready to get this thing off, but I heard my doorbell ding. So I think somebody might be down at the car lot. So take me away, scooter thing. Oh, I didn't know I had a digital thing on there. Oh, heck yeah. Watch out, scooter man coming through. No, 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 no. All right, so I got a customer sitting inside the building. They actually, I guess the bus dropped them off or something. They said they were looking at this cat up here, and they were like, how much you want for it? I'm like, I'll take like maybe 25 for it, which I know it's a lot, but again, look at the market values right now. So I was like, I'll take like 25 for it. I mean, it's nice, you know, we went over it with fine tooth comb. And I'm pretty sure this was actually a trade-in and everything. So we're going to take it down there. Listen to that bad boy. We're going to take it down here. Let them listen to it and everything. Maybe take it for a test drive. Hopefully we can come to an agreement and everything. I mean, I'll go down to 20. But 25 is what we're going to start out with. So. Pull it up here. I'll pull it let it run. Let them hear it run. This thing is super clean. I actually hate to get rid of it, but... That's the problem, I try to keep everything. That's why I have a second garage over there. All right, so we made a deal at 25. They're sitting in everything. I think they're gonna do whatever they need to do. Um, and they're gonna be leaving soon. Hey, thank you for your business. Thank you very much. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and head on out here. I think I, they're going to go like meet their son or something. So we'll let them do them their thing. So we made 25 off of that, or 22 uh, five is uh, what we sold for. So that's not bad. Apparently they just, they really been wanting a diesel and they've been saving up. I'm like well, that's good because if you can save up and go buy one straight up with cash, you're doing pretty good. All right, now let's go ahead and get this bad boy off of here so we can continue our work. Of course, I mean. Making money is air air work, but you you know what I mean. Well, if if I can get the hitch, then. all right, got that. Now let's go ahead and jump in this bad boy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Go ahead, let's back this bad boy in. I like this garage is higher than the other, so it's like you got a little hill you gotta drive up. Alright, hopefully this new uh this new um uh, 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 list would be better. See I do like this better than the other one because it's a whole lot bigger, so please work and do good. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. Well, how far are you going up? I'm gonna have to get a ladder just to get up here. Well, this thing is like extremely detailed in here. I like it and everything. Oh, we got some rust on the bed. You can see, you can see through it. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's see. I think we're going to put lift blocks and stuff on. So let's go ahead and do that. And we're going to change the t rims and tires. Maybe put some like chrome fins or something on. I'm going to see what I can get uh, here today. All right. So we went ahead and put a little bit bigger tires and everything on. Um, we, we actually went with more leafs to lift it and stuff. It didn't take that many. Um, I think it's like two or three and everything. So she's a lot more stout and everything. The only thing is, I do like this bed. It's a long bed, but I actually like long beds. Um, I actually have a first gen IRL. Uh, I mean, I guess it's kind of, I mean, their papers going to like fuss, but the power wagon, I mean, they kind of look, the body style still looks the same all the way up almost like a 92. There is some differences and stuff, but I know like the grill's different. The, uh, the interior is different and everything like that. But just like the body lines and stuff. That's how my first gen IRL is and everything. But got the uh, lift and everything on. Got some mud tires and everything. We're going to get ready and paint it. I think I'm going to paint it maybe like a... Not a gray, but like a bluish gray. You'll have to see. It's going to look pretty. So let me go ahead and get some paint mixed up and everything. And we're going to slap it on this beast. 
Alright, so we went ahead and got that. Check that out. Now, I actually really like this color. It's like a bluish gray color. Um, they probably got over spray all over that crap. So. Anyways, we got that. I, <coughs> goodness, excuse me. I, I think it looks really good. It's like a bluish gray. I'm not so sure the actual name of it or anything. But let's go ahead and hop in this bad boy. Look at this base. Now, I went ahead and did a couple of things to the engine and everything. Just, you know, some some uh, better spark plugs and just, you know, just, just a tune up and everything. So, hopefully we got a little bit more, a little bit more up and everything in it. Alright, where everything seems pretty good in the truck, everything seems good. It, 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 it drives really good. I want to take it down below the bridge right here just to see what she's got and everything. We're not going to do anything crazy with it because we are going to try to sell it. How much flex do we have on this thing? We still, we still, oh goodness. Yeah, this thing has almost enough flex as the Cummins does. Oh snap, oh snap, oh snap, oh snap. Okay, I about just killed it. Like we bought a mint condition, mint condition, uh, uh, leak power wagon, and it's like mud after we lift it and stuff. That sounds like what we do. Uh oh, uh oh, oh boy. I don't know how good this thing climbs. Come on. Oh yeah, like a glove, like a glove. Alright, so this one is gotta go for sale. I really want to put this in my collection, but it's just, I got to sell it. And I actually think this will probably might be so pretty quick and everything, so I'm going to put this one down here too. Oh, after I hit a pole with it, you know. Check it out. We got the old classics and it goes to the new and everything. If that truck right there, I want to leave in the comments how much you think this truck would be worth and everything and how much we try to sell it for. Because hopefully we can get the money out of it. Still like the old square body too. That's a good truck. I feel like I just need to like daily it. All right. Well, we're gonna head back to the shop, close it down for today because we did do some work. Um, I'm hoping to get some kind of you know work done with the uh, the dealership and everything. Because I'm ready to get the trucks out of the grass and actually on the parking lot and stuff. And I'm ready to get the rest of this road paved and everything. So. You know, basically, we're, we're air dealerships up and run to the full extent because right now it's just, you know, it looks like kind of like a crap shoot. Here looks pretty official, but you know how it is. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the videos. Make sure you hit that like button. Always helps out the channel. And uh, just drop a comment on what you think of today's video. Anyways, I am <laughs> out of here, America, baby. Uh, and always remember, keep the wheel rolling here at Hamster Wheels, where we have a lot of junk and. Some of it may or may not have bent wheels. <laughs>